Well, good evening, lovely reborn community. It is I, and I just wanted to come really quick and share with you guys where the boys' clothes are um, stored in the nursery because I realize you guys have, I don't think I've done a video where I've recorded the inside of the closet for the boys. So, but anyway, this is the boys' closet. Some of their winter wear is hanging up in uh, complete outfits, and then. I have one clothes in that container, and I have my, which is 4T, 3T and 4T, and then my 24-month-old clothes, and then 0 to 3, 6 onesies and pants, and then 3 to 6 and some 9-month stuff in there. And so I just wanted to show you guys that really quickly. The top of the closet has crochet bathtub, and over there in the corner is reborn and stuff. Um, those are those these uh we can't even see in here but anyway it's stuff where uh these little container things have drawers where you can put stuff inside of them and so that's reborn supplies and you guys can't see over here either but this big uh bag is all their christmas stuff and then i got just a couple of the girls christmas dresses hanging up and then um hangers so, I'm going to come out the closet and pause really quick. Okay, and then I'm just going into more stuff that I've added. That's me back there in the mirror that I've added to the nursery. So, this um, crib has storage space inside of it. And that's pretty much what this video is about. Where do I house all my reborn stuff? So, that's her accessory, her these these kind and then i have another one for nothing but crochet ones and this one is uh specifically crochet headbands and then under there is some more stuff but anyway you guys see that bed is empty i move uh the two cubbies off of that shelf and added these two little girls and then there's still cubbies at the bottom so what else? I took the boys' clothes out of those three cubbies and just put bottles, diapers, and passies, and then um, blankets. And inside these cubbies have um, Naima, the big girl shoes. And then over here, this cubby has the little baby shoes. And then I made this little to cover this up because it has 24 to 3T, and they look a mess, I know um clothes but inside of this also has the big boy shoes so <laughs> that is how i've been able to house a lot of stuff and here is the silky bowls the clip bowls and then at the back i have my crocheted headbands these are nothing but the passies over here draw full of passies oh let me show you guys um Parent Choice has new passies. So these are just a couple of them. And then they got some more new passies. Which are these. In case you guys didn't know that. Parent Choice has new passies. And so I love it because it's just $1.27 for the pack. Also I store um, stuffing and weighting materials in those. And then... I bought another cubby set. I haven't started filling it up yet, but this one has her accessories. And this one, I'm going to just keep little receiving blankets, and it's going to go in one of these drawers. But I'm going to keep receiving blankets in that, and the other two is empty. And over here, um, well, I'm not going to go through all the drawers, because <laughs> that's just going to be hectic. But they have socks, hats, and bibs, and then all of the babies' uh, sleepers, and then they have some of the whole onesie sets and that see it's dark over here and here is nothing but shorts and um jamborees and stuff and so anyway i'm just showing you guys some of the ways i house stuff this ain't nothing but a bag full of ribbons and yeah you guys that is it and so um i was sitting up watching a movie and it's daylight outside so i was like let me get some videos in before um the daylight is gone. I hung up those four little dollar uh, crates. They came from the Dollar Tree for a book. 
and just put um their picture books and um it got little bracelets in the containers and stuff and then you see the baby magic spray up there and then uh the bear is holding hair bows and the brats is holding more small clips so i have all these babies but i found managed to find a way to store um a lot of their stuff and so i'm trying to take the camera off of some of the babies because i plan on coming back doing videos of them so but anyway you guys this was just a quick little video of how i store um clothes for all of these babies there got more cubbies over there and so it looks like it's an inconvenience to have miss crochet there but the bed rolls right all away and i can get to the bottom two drawers which are mostly gowns and if you guys notice i don't put my girls in a lot of gowns so the draw she's blocking off is actually fine for me anyway i shall return with more hope you guys are having a beautiful sunday bye bye